For those looking to sell or buy muck coins, check out buycheapmuckcoins.com. Use code TEXAS at checkout to get 5% off your order. We are on the Ultimate Master grind, and this is what my team looks like. Tyron Smith at left tackle, and we got Joe Thomas at right tackle. In the middle, we got a bunch of guys that can run block their ass off. Tyler Offer playing tight end. Our receiving core is nasty. Odo back with Mari Cooper, Mark Tavis, Bryant, who pretty much is like young Randy Moss. We got Todd Gurley, and we have John Elway at quarterback. And now on to the defense. We have the key to success, which is speed. Everybody on my defense, except for a few guys here and there has at least 90 plus sweet yeah i'm gonna need to replace this kj right with Levante david but i'm gonna go ahead and use him for right now we got shazier buchanan we got zadarius smith aka zeus court vic we got cameron haywood who i'm probably gonna end up benching because i do now have that Derek wolf and Derek wolf power move is kind of low but his speed is unmatched at that end spot at cornerback we got two robies i don't care i'm gonna go ahead and abuse this future of the game run two of these guys 96 speed crazy we got trey waynes in the nickel who's played pretty well and we have the best free safety in the game in Tyre Matthew. Let's get into the game. Pretty much all these game plays with this team, with the 89 overall team, with the Roadmaster team, is going to be post commentary simply because I really want to go ahead and knock it out. I've been slacking, yeah. I've been completely just not playing. I got Muttmaster done and. Guys, video is on the way. I've been saying it for about six months. But I got that thing done and just haven't really had the urge to play this game. But now, because Super Bowl is almost upon us and we have more stuff coming out and honors and shit like that, I think we'll be getting Ultimate Master sometime soon. So I'm going to go ahead and knock out this Roadmaster stuff. Go ahead and get those five collectibles. Get that get that Tom Brady. Go ahead and sell him for a lot of coins. And then go ahead and get Ultimate Master done when that comes out in the next couple of weeks, I would assume. Trying to let me go back and check and see what Ultimate Master actually dropped last year. So it looks like Ultimate Master dropped around February 13th last year, which means I have about 12 days to go ahead and knock out all these games. All of these games just to get the collectible before the set drops, hopefully. So I'm going to go ahead and start playing head to head like this. And the games that are good, I'm going to go ahead and record them and throw them up for YouTube so you guys can watch me on my Ultimate Master or my Roadmaster grind. So hopefully, go ahead and win some of these games. Then we can go ahead and get this shit done in a timely fashion because. Last year, I was kind of a late bloomer, y'all. I only got finished Mutt Mash till on February 9th. Like, I finished it so late last year. Like, Road Mash was easier last year than it was this year. And because of that, I made a lot of coins. And that's how I'm going to get my coins back up. I'm broke right now over here in Madden. You guys saw me pull a million coins and not get a goddamn thing in packs. And so now I got to go ahead and get, work my way back up. So, anyway, let's go ahead and watch this game play on the background. My opponent is just throwing drag routes. No clue why that is. It seems like that is not a smart idea. Yo, throw the ball down the field at least. I'm not here at cover three. Really easy to dot up, but this guy is not trying to go deep on me. He's just trying to throw these drag routes as he's scrambling with that 91 Kirk Cousins. He gets gang tackled, and gang tackles on quarterbacks pretty much always result in a fumble. So now I've got the ball back up by three, trying to get the ball down the field, going deep which ends up getting intercepted by 81 overall Dick Lane. Now, I'm going to go ahead and blame Elway on that because he was playing with two safeties deep. Not in the middle, but just two safeties playing the third of the field. That should have been a touchdown, but Elway got pressured and threw a pick. And then on back-to-back -back play, this guy throws a pick right back to me, Tyron Matthew with the pick. Try to get out of field, get an interception return for a touchdown, but we're going to get it taken down at the 50. So we got the ball back. No more mistakes going deep to Cooper, who had some running room, but he got a weird catching animation. But it gives us a first and 10, get the ball to Todd Gurley, and we're going to try to get our way to the end zone. And he gets tackled by Lawrence Taylor. This team is pretty good. Pretty stacked team play action fake. And look at Sean Taylor out here just lurking. Yo, Sean Taylor was supposed to be guarding Tyler Eifert, but because I guess he just switched. He just had the awareness of Larry just to switch on to guard somebody else as... Damn, yo, Jerk McKinnon is fast, man. Jerk McKinnon is fast. I'm glad he was out there because I don't think Tar really would have ran him down. That run down didn't even matter anyway because he got in the end zone on the very next play. So now we are down by four points in the third quarter. On third and two, I'm going short, man. I'm going short right to a quick slide. This guy had the user. He would have got the pick there or the big hit knocked down. But because this guy's not that great, we end up getting a nice catch there. Go ahead and run the ball second inches with Todd Gurley running the ball once again. This guy's out here getting the ball down the field. Yo, Gurley is amazing, man. This card might be the best halfback in the game on certain days. Yo, he just can't catch. He can't catch, and because he can't catch, that costs you some points there. But right here, some levels to this stuff. I see he's out here in cover three. Go ahead and put a guy in the flat, put a guy in the string, and put a guy on a out slash corner route, and that always results in a touchdown. So now we go up by three. 
First and 10. It's a huge blitz at this guy. Anthony Barr coming off the edge is just unfair, yo. You guys might want to go ahead and pick yourself up one and send him on a blitz because he's going to get there very, very fast. Right here, he throws another drag route being so far from the first down marker. No clue why this guy loves drag routes. Finally goes down the middle of the field, which has been open the entire game. And Tyre Matthews' play rec was amazing. And once again, don't throw at Tyron Matthew because this guy is the best safety in this game and he is going to knock those passes down more often than get mossed on. He's only five foot eight. It's crazy. So my opponent is like, you know what? I'm done. Even though the game is still within reach. Like I have not really shown him anything too special on offense. And the guy decides he's had enough of this game and go ahead and quit. So that is the first game on the road to Roadmaster and hopefully Old Master very, very soon. So hope you guys enjoy. I'm a Texas boy and I'll catch up mother bleepers in the next one. Peace. Take off, take my body, go. Take our bodies higher.